Hey guys, welcome from Red Motors, and today we're going to do our Tundra build, episode number 9. Uh, again, if you guys like this video, go ahead and like, subscribe, and turn on your push notification. And also, if you guys need any prepaid auto body parts, go to redmotor.com and prepaid auto body parts source. And also, don't forget, on April 21st, we're going to be doing our giveaway. The three touch-up models, three lucky winners. So remember, go to the last past ep go to the past episodes, comment down below, and also don't forget to subscribe. So do those two things, subscribe and comment down below, so you guys can get entered to win that touch-up model. But let's go ahead and start on this uh, Tundra build. Alright guys, so we did a little bit of performance upgrade. Let me show you how the car sounds. by us, it's done by someone else that stole a catalytic converter. So let me show you guys what they did. So you know, they could have just opened the gate up or climbed up on the gate. That could have been a lot easier. But they decided to go ahead and do this move. Went ahead and bolt cut. I think they used a bolt cutter. I don't know what they used. But yeah, they did, they did that to our, uh, our facility, so they stole our catalytic converter. So just a little bit of warning for you Tundra owners or Toyota owners. Make sure you get your Toyotas, your Priuses, your Forerunners, your Tacomas, a little bit uh, secured, put in the garage. They're stealing those, uh, those uh, catalytic converters right now, especially it's hot in Houston right now. But I'm going to show you guys how to prevent that. Alright guys, so let me show you how they steal it so you guys can be aware of how it's going to be done. If you guys look underneath, our trucks are lifted up really high. So all you got to do is go underneath and with a saw saw, they just cut the ends. You see that? They just cut it. They don't even, they don't even have the, uh, the technical ability to unbolt it. That would have been a lot easier for me to replace it. And then they, they, I think there's like four cats, so two on each side, so yeah. They, they got they got me on this one. How long does it take? So to cut this up by a professional, this is like a professional job. Probably take them like five minutes, five ten minutes, real easy. All right, so they steal these uh, catalytic converters because you know there's special metal in them. The scrapyards takes them for like two hundred dollars on up. So the the actual precious metal that's associated with these uh, catalytic converters are gonna be, I think. Uh, let me just. Do Google it up. Platinum, palladium, and rhodium. I don't even know what that is, but I guess it's a lot of money. It's two hundred dollars and up for the uh, for the scrapyards to take it. So they got four. That's an easy eight hundred dollars. But for me to replace this, it's gonna cost me around twenty five hundred on the low side, and I think like even Toyota support me up to five thousand. That's just like the parts itself. Not even doing the welding, the insulation, all that stuff. I don't know how much that would be. Uh, I would say I think like I, look, I looked at a ton, uh, Toyota Tundra Forum. Someone said nine thousand dollars. That's crazy. So for eight hundred dollars, they're gonna make eight hundred dollars for me. It's gonna replace to replace it back ordered also two to three months. That's gonna cost me at least nine thousand dollars from on the high side. So you know, you gotta be be aware of your surroundings. Be careful uh, if there's. You know, if, if you scare them off, that's great. But if they're doing stuff to it, just call the police. Be safe. It's not worth it. You know, call your insurance company also. All right, guys. I'm going to show you a couple ways actually to help prevent them from stealing your catalytic converter. And also, one of the ways I would say always put your car in the garage. You know, that's the best way. The second one, I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys on this video right here. Hey guys, so this is a 2014 uh, Toyota Tundra that's our friend's truck. And we're going to show you what he did to prevent uh, his catalytic converter from being stolen. So he got a 3 16 inch steel plate. But let's go down. And 
and it covers the catalytic converter from front to back so nobody cuts it off and steals it. And this was custom made. This is someone here in Houston uh, locally makes these plates. We got giant bolts up here. So this is more difficult to cut through uh, than the cat pipe. You can have a hard time cutting through this with your saw. So most of the time they use a battery operated battery operated sawzall. Um, yeah, so you know battery operated saw gonna get through this. If it does, it's gonna take a long time. So this is really thick, it covers the whole bottom. So this is one way to prevent theft of your catalytic converter and save you like five grand uh, in the process. Let's get another view. So this plate was around 275. Mm -hmm. uh, and as you can see, the back cats are still exposed. But if you were to cut them on this end, it'd be super hard to get your saw in there. Even though you can still cut it here. And there is another plate you can purchase that'll go back from here till about here. It'll cover the, the back cats. What they call back cats? The rear cats. <laughs> they'll cover the rear cats from over here. Right? What else can you do to, to prevent theft? Uh, people have been painting their cats, like painting them bright colors, like red. Why? Just so that if they get taken to a scrap, oh, they know it's stolen. They know it's stolen, yeah. Or people will engrave their VIN number oh, into yeah. the cat. Yeah. You can also just take the cats off and then install a. You could also delete them if you really wanted to. What do you call it? Highly illegal. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's because of missions, right? Yeah. Alright, so you need cats. Yes. Hey guys, the original audio was just way too windy. We apologize for that. But uh, this is what happened to our Tundra. Hopefully it doesn't happen to your Tundra or your Prius. Those are the two hot vehicles that are getting their con catalytic converters stolen. Uh, it's happening all over the place. So take the right preventative measures. Uh, stay safe. Uh, don't forget we're giving free touch-up paint away next week on the 21st. So all you have to do is comment on our Tundra Baja build videos. There's nine episodes. The more you comment, the more entries you have. And subscribe to our channel. Thank you.